I just want to show you view modes now, which allows you to preview how your vector artwork would look if you'd exported it at non-retina and retina quality. As well as that, an, another view mode allows you to see the outline or the skeleton structure of your vector design. Although anyone could take advantage of view modes for previewing export, they're particularly useful for icon designers because they let you env envisage how a particular icon will look when it's presented on a web page or on a uh, mobile phone mock-up. So I've used this example as a result of that and we've got a series of icons here and we're just going to focus on this pencil tool here. Now if I just go into zoom in on it and I'll just initially switch off the background for more clarity. Um, I'll be able to just, uh, just select the pencil tool and then just run through a few of the view modes. So first of all we have pixel view mode and that gives me a representation of the icon in non-retina preview. I can change that to retina preview so you get a higher level of quality as expected from uh, retina um, op options and you'd use this for display on retina monitors and mobile phone devices. So the distinction between vector non-retina and retina is quite clear cut here but if you want to make comparisons on the screen between the different uh, view modes you can just come to the view menu choose split view and simply drag across the page. Now on the right hand side I have vector and on the left hand side I have retina. So I can compare exactly how my output would appear on the left to my original. So I can swap these around, I can just enable that one, make them both vector and then make that one retina on the right. So you've got the exact opposite comparison. I can change the retina view to non-retina and I can compare that non-retina with retina. So there are plenty of options here. I'll just switch that off for the moment because I want to show you the final option which is this option here which is outline view mode. Now rather than being used to preview or export this is a way of seeing how your vector artwork has been structured. So if I enable that you see a wireframe view so you're not getting any stroke properties or fills here, you're just literally seeing the outline of the design. So equally if I go up to view, split view, I can see the outline versus how it would look with non-retina, how it would look with retina and if I switch that off how it would look against the original vector artwork. If I just come backwards and forwards you can see that quite powerful distinction there. Now one quite cool feature is if I just uh, target this particular area of the design this kind of area here, I'll just move this out of the way so you see the area of shading I can move this around in the design just to get it to a point where I'm comfortable with the particular look of it and optionally just drag um, just to make sure that it's as intended.